I'm Forrest Griffin, VP of Athlete Development at the UFC Performance Institute. And one of the things I get to do is to make sure that everything we do here works to actually make the athlete better in the octagon. Our goals of the UFC Performance Institute are to elongate athletes' careers, to allow them to fight more often, to feel better when they fight. And again, that's where making the way comes in. The PI's mission is just to help fighters maximize their potential. Jessica Andrade, crazy thing about her is she's fought everywhere from 135, obviously 125, and then she's been champion at 115. She's going back down, and she was a little worried about making that weight, so she actually came in 13 or 14 weeks before the fight to really start dial it in. You know, she listened to the advice. She ate the meals that were prescribed to her by the sports dietetics team, and she's gonna have a very easy, acute water cut. She'll be well-fueled and fresh and rested going into her fight. Back to it, Tuesday, fight week, check-ins. Forrest, where we at with everybody? I know you guys have been working with Jessica Andrade quite a bit. How's her weight? What's she doing? I know she's fought a ton of weight classes, down at 115 again for the first time in a long time. She's in a really good spot to have a manageable weight cut this week, I and mean, I expect it to go very well. Right. I saw some work you did recently too over the last what four weeks of heat acclimation doing some spending some time in the sauna making sure she's prepared for weight cut as well as some of the, the performance benefits there. Energy's good, training's going great, very prepared. Weight's good, the heat acclimation is going to come into play. Mentally going to be ready, then physically she's going to be prepared for all that heat stress as well. When we do check-ins on Tuesday with the athletes that's when we start to dig down into the hydration status and the fuel, like how much glycogen they have in them. Basically, how much weight do they have to give easily? All right, it is Tuesday, we're at the host hotel. I'm helping out as far as when and where they're gonna do their weight cut, right? So they're gonna tell me what time they wanna train, how they wanna kinda of stack their weight cut or the last bit of their weight descent onto that practice. Hey, you're well, welcome. So athletes will uh, give me a couple basic pieces of information. What's their training schedule for the week and what modalities are they using for their acute water cut? Oh, Everything's going well with food? Beautiful, thank you. <laughs> Finish training day. Are you training to at the PI tomorrow? Tomorrow, tomorrow? yeah. My about 3.30. So Thursday she's gonna do her cut here? Yeah. There's a lot of amazing technology. There's a lot of very cool things we do. And an athlete or an MMA coach, they might not have the background to understand the specifics of those, but they do wanna know, hey, how can this actually help me win fights? How can this make me feel better? How can this help me have an easier time making the weight? How long have you guys been linked up to make 115 for her? Mm, I would say at least like 12 weeks about. Só tenho que se não fosse o Dan, o negócio não tinha, não tinha fluído não. Na última luta que eu fui para 52, eh, eu tava muito mal, então não, não tive todo esse acompanhamento e alguém para me incentivar a fazer tudo certo, né? E aqui o com o PI e com o Dan e com toda a estrutura, eu consegui fazer tudo certinho da forma mais correta para essa semana, todo esse jeito, relax, tranquilo e para lutar feliz demais. Yeah, it takes so much it's strong. Yeah, this fight, I'm very good, very fast, strong. It's good fighting. Yeah. One of the things we've learned is that if somebody shows up 10% over their competition check-in weight, that could be very an easy cut or a very difficult cut depending on how fueled and hydrated they are. There's a lot of modalities to cut weight. One of the things that's really exciting is when we get to work with an athlete over a long period of time and we have specific information as to their sweat rate. We know how long it's gonna take them to break a sweat and how much weight, water weight, they're gonna lose in that period of time. It is 3.30 on a Wednesday. Today is the kind of the last day that most fight card athletes, so athletes that are fighting Saturday, come in to, to do a little actual physical work. <laughs> you know, these athletes, hopefully the hard training is done and they're actually in a recovery phase or a taper deload week. So they're not gonna work out super hard. 
Today they'll, they'll kind of hone in the last bit of game planning, technical skills. If you are a professional, you're able to make that cut and then rehydrate. You feel very good. All right, so it's Thursday morning. We are at the check-in hotel. We are giving out their uh, cut kit, if you will, uh, with sweet sweat, uh, sauna blanket. All right, well, so there's some sweet sweat and then some scented sweet sweat. You know how to use these. Have you used the blankets before? So sweet sweat was originally designed to target certain areas of the body that need more blood flow. Two types of sweet sweat here, coconut scented and unscented. You put it on and it has a thermogenic effect. It helps you break sweat faster and it helps increase your sweat rate. You can increase the blood flow and the thermogenic effect to different parts of your body using sweet sweat. You got the portable sauna in your room. You know how to use the stuff. This one here? Yeah, yeah. It's good. it's good? Yeah, yeah. You've used it before. The idea is that they, they make that acute water cut, they cut the fuel, the fiber, the glycogen, the sodium, etc. And then they put those things back in. So when they do fight Saturday, they've had about 30 hours and they feel great. triangle for Andrade. Andrade's got this tight. And she is very physically strong, as we know. Come back. That, 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 oh! that, 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 that.